Hello and welcome back to FemDesign video lessons. In this video you will learn how to check the PAR internal forces and PAR stresses in FemDesign software. We are going to start in analysis tab and in here you can see that I have already calculated my model. From quick tools we are going to select results, analysis, load combinations and in here you will see par internal forces and par stresses. I'm gonna click from here and in here you will see uh, for the par forces first you will have normal force then you will have shear forces you will also have torsion moment and bending moments here. For the par stresses we have uh, maximum normal stress, tension, and we have minimum normal stress, compression. Uh, we have those maximum and minimum, and we have sigma von Mises stresses here. And like for everything in here, you can activate these to your VR over here. I'm just going to select the normal force, the combination, and do I want to display it as a graph or color palette? Like this. I'm just gonna select my view to be like this. And here, like for everything else, you can scale the results up. And you can, uh, for this example, maybe use the automatic numeric values. Maybe like this. So we don't have that much in our view. Oh, let's select only this bar to be in the view. Like this and let's select this. So here we have automatic uh, local maximum and minimum for this bar element here. Of course, you can once again use detailed results function and in here, you will have all the forces shown in the results. And here, you, you can change the bar element. You can change uh, if you want to show the load case or the combination or the maximum of load combinations. And in here, for example, you can select the different kind of load combinations. The same automatic numeric values or numeric values are also seen in here. So for example, I'm going to select here and select this. So now I have uh, my local maximum and minimum values shown. Of course, I can use this tool to select the parts I want to check or the parts from the bars I want to check. Now we are going to go back and in here I'm going to select bar stresses. I'm going to select here, display, and now I can see the stress on my bar. For this also, you can use the detailed results. And in the detailed results, you can check the local stresses for this bar, like this here. And what you can also do is change the part or, or the place, placement where you want to check those local stresses in your bar by moving this like here. So when I move this, you can change that uh, the different part of my bar is now shown in my results here. And of course, you will have the same selection here. Here you can select the bars you want to check. Do you want to check the load case, load combination, and the load combination selection, and all the display options that you are already seen in the previous videos. I'm just going to go back. And so, here was all for this video. I hope you learned something new. I want to thank you for watching, and see you in the next one.